G'day YouTubers, what's happening? Today I'm going to be doing another Martian build, the uh, Martian version 2 from uh, Banggood. Uh, this build is going to be uh, it's a 6 inch build, it's got 6 inch arms, uh, probably a little bit better quality product than I'm going to than uh, my last Martian build. You want to check that out? I'll leave a little link up here for you. Uh, main difference is probably a better board, better ESCs. I'm going to be trying out these uh, new XM Plus Free Sky receivers, uh, little miniature things, tiny little things. Uh, the version 2 before Omnibus, so it includes the SD card and a barometer. Not that I'll be using the barometer, but it's on there. Uh, and I'm using the Emacs mode as the 2205, 2600 KVs. The old red bottoms. Uh, ESC, it's a new DYS XSD 30 amp version 2s. Um, BOLE D sharp 3 to 6 cell. They're, um, just get smaller and smaller, aren't they? Um, these actually come with a little cage type cover thing as well. So you can then um, don't have to worry about taping them or anything like that if you're worried about prop strikes and stuff like that. Just go in this nice little cage. So you can just clip them down to the arm like that rather than using tape or tape or something. Yeah, it might look a little bit cleaner. I don't know, the whole electrical tape wrapped around the arms doesn't really do it for me. I'd like to do it a different way. So maybe these cages would be good. So this build, I'm not going to go through every little bit of soldering or anything like that. Um, there's plenty of videos on soldering, but I will give you a, a quick demo on each each bit and how I've hooked it up and how I've wired it up. So yeah, hope you enjoy. I'll uh, get to putting this frame together and get back to you. So before I put the PDB on, I'm just going to solder up the power wire. Give you a quick look on how I do that. So always when soldering these, if they get too hot, the pins can come loose and pull out of out of alignment. And then when they when the plastic cools down again, they're out of line and pretty much killed it. So what I like to do is just use uh, the other end. Plug it in there, and then it holds all the pins nicely in place. Another thing, always check and make sure you're doing the right side. So the curved edge is negative, flat edge is positive.
Oh yeah, who teamed up? Ta da! Yeah! <laughs>